Hi, so it is Monday and we're going to review mean, median, mode, and range. But before we do that, I'm going to tell you the days of the week that we missed. So let me pull those up really fast. Hold on one second. So Friday, the day we don't have school, it is Encourage a Young Writer Day. Saturday the 11th is National Cheese Fondue Day. The 12th, which is Easter, it's National Grilled Cheese Day. And the 13th, which is Monday, is National Peach Cobbler Day. So we're just going to review some mean, median, mode, and range. If you remember, hey, diddle, diddle, the median's the middle. You add and divide for the mean. The mode is the one you see the most. The range is the difference between. So let's go over this. Hey, diddle, diddle, the median's the middle. So I'm going to put C for middle. You add and divide for the mean. The mode is the one you see the most, and the range is the difference between. So I was using that. So let's do this. Remember, the first step you have to do is put the numbers in order. So 1, 1, 2, 3, 5, 6. And I count. There's 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6 digits. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6. Okay. So hey, diddle, diddle, the median's the middle. So I'm going to do the middle. I have two in the middle, or I mean two and three, so I know that between that is two and a half. So two and a half is the middle. Hey, diddle, diddle, the median is the middle. You add and divide for the mean. So one plus one is two. I'm just going to count up. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Seven plus five is twelve. Twelve plus six is eighteen. You divide by one, two, three, four, five, six numbers. So you're going to get the mean is three. The mode is the one you see the most. I see two ones, and the range is the difference between. So 6 minus 1 is 5. Okay, I'm going to clear the ink so I have room. So first up, I have to put these in order. So this one, there's a lot of numbers. So 3, I see a 6, I see a 7, I see 1, 2, 3, 12s, and I see an 18. So hey diddle diddle, the median's the middle. So the median would be 12. You add and divide for the mean, so we're going to add. Well, first off, I know 3 12s is going to be 36. Um, I know 6 plus 7 is 13, 14, 15, 16. And I'm going to add 18. So if I add that all up, 6 plus 6 is 12, plus 8 would be 20. 2 plus 1 is 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, so 70. Divided by 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. So 70 divided by 7 is 10. So the mean, you add and divide for the mean. The mode is the one you see the most. I see three twelves. The range is the difference between 18 minus 3 is 15. And then there's one more thing we're going to do. Oh, I have to take a picture of it. Hold on. So this is kind of hard to see, but a few years ago, I um, made a line plot with my class, and I asked them what subject is most popular. So this is really hard to see. It's even hard to see on my computer. So I'm going to write about this is science. This is health. This is social studies. This is math. And this is reading. And then the one I over here is writing. That reading, I don't even know. That doesn't look like reading. Let me make that a little bit better. Still not very good, but okay. Now, so the question was how many kids are surveyed? So remember from an X or a line plot, every X is a person. So 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26, 27, 28, 29. So the, if the question was how many were surveyed, the answer would be 29 are surveyed. What subject is most popular? You can see that's reading. Were there any ties? Well, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 1, 1, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, and one, two, three, four, five. So I see two ties. There's a tie between science and writing and health and social studies. Which subject had a frequency of seven? That would have been math. 
So those were those questions. Um, so just kind of showing you that you can do that mean, medium, mode, and range type of project or problems with a X plot. So that was really easy for math. Um, I don't want to move into another subject, but hopefully you remember mean, median, mode, and range. I do just want to review one thing. If I have four numbers, and I'm trying to find the mo or sorry, the, the median, the middle number, and I have two random numbers, how I do that is I actually find the mean of the two numbers or the average of the two numbers. So I add them up. So 18, I'm going to count up 19, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24, 25, 26. And then I divide by how many numbers are, which would be 2 in this case. So the middle number would be 13. So if you don't have a middle, you add them up, the 2 in the middle, and you divide by 2. So you find an average of the app for that. Okay? So that's it for today. So math is really short. Bye.